Processes can use either a trace or a snap action switch to provide an electrical response to the rise or fall in pressure or temperature. System pressures and temperatures rarely follow a smooth pattern of rising and falling, and the switches used to track and control the system are subject to those fluctuations, as illustrated in this graph. Deciding whether to use a snap action design is critical to your switch's efficiency, accuracy, and longevity. This video will cover key differences between each device and how they are applied to the switch operation. What is the difference between a trace switch and a snap action switch? In their simplest form, pressure switches have two components, a mechanism that reacts to a change in pressure and an electrical switch sometimes called a micro switch when the pressure or temperature reaches a certain level the set point the mechanism moves to actuate the switch this process can either allow or stop currents in the control circuit the trace mechanism common alternative mechanisms to snap action devices are trace designs also known as spring-based mechanisms Switches with a trace mechanism follow or trace the exact pattern of pressure or temperature changes. These trace devices can include a helical spring or spiral spring, a Borden tube, or bellows in their mechanism. A spring-based trace switch mimics the pattern of changes even after the set point is reached. The mechanism and micro switch are in constant motion when there are changes in pressure in the system. This continual movement wears on the components of the mechanism and electrical switch. And over time, it causes the set point to drift from the original setting to fatigue and failure of the mechanism. The Snap Action Mechanism Unlike trace switches, a snap action mechanism remains inactive during system pressure and temperature changes. When the set point is reached, the snap acting disc in the mechanism immediately reacts to activate the switch. Eliminating this ongoing motion until the point of activation and deactivation can reduce the mechanism and switch element wear, extending its duration. Snap action designs are the premium type of switch on the market. They can perform 10 million cycles or more, due to the low fatigue of the components, including the micro switch. While trace and snap action pressure and temperature switches may perform the same function, Understanding the difference in their movement and precision explains why quality-minded people prefer snap action switches over other designs. Trace designs fatigue the mechanism and the internal micro switch through constant motion. Snap action switches use an innovative snap action disc spring that remains still, despite fluctuations, until action is needed. The company CCS pioneered the dual snap, snap action disc. It is used to provide accurate and reliable pressure and temperature measurement under every operation. For more information on CCS pressure and temperature switches, contact Mountain States Engineering and Controls.